Hey everyone, this is Platinum. Today I'm going to be doing a comparison. There's a, um, out of two palettes, there's a very popular palette that everyone has almost called the Coastal Sense 88 palette. And it's MAC and Pearl Shimmer colors. It's 88 different colors. And then ELF has a 100 palette that they just came out with so today basically this is going to be a quick little tutorial i'm going to compare everything from the size the weight the packaging the price and the colors so let's get started with um coastal scent this is the packaging and this is the 88 palette and here's eyes lip and face 100 palette obviously in terms of how they look to me this one wins a lot of people complain because they say when they get these palettes, their colors are broke already. But the company has no problem shipping out a new one. So that's kind of like good for you because all the colors that wasn't broke in the first one, you get to use them. So that's like more for your money. But they do need to work on that because who wants to get a broken package? So I would suggest that they bubble wrap it or... Well, that's about their only option is the bubble wrap it since it's being mailed and they can't control how the carriers handle them. But yeah, and compare it to, I mean, comparing the packaging, this is really cute and neat looking to me. Okay, as far as size, even though this has extra 12 more colors than this one, yeah, they weigh about the same. So if you have to pack them down for a trip or you're going to do something, they weigh about the same. So as far as weight, this, um, neither one advantages over the other one. Now, as far as price, that probably should have been the first thing I went over. The Coastal Scent Pack palette is, I think it's $18.95, but it does have $8 shipping and handling. So, that brings it all the way up to $25, but it's still worth it. And then the Eyes, Lips, and Face palette, it was $10, but all of a sudden, since it's closer to the holidays, it's jumped up to $15. So, um... This one is 15. If you anything that you get shipped from Eyes, Lips, and Face, I think it has a 6.95 shipping and handling fee. So that's the shipping on this one. So this one is cheaper. You get more colors, and it's cheaper. Now, as far as packaging, I've had problems with both of these palettes. My Coastal Scent 88 palette, my little thing is broke right here. So I have to do like all kind of weird stuff just to open it. The little latch thing that comes right here. It broke off like the second day I got it. So, that's the negative for that palette. And as far as this um, 100 palette, after you've had it, well, some people say as soon as they get it. These things right here, the hinges break. Right here. The hinges break and that's kind of like inconvenient. But... I don't know. That's the negative to both. They Both companies can work on their packaging a little bit. This um, comes with a little mirror right here with two sponge brushes. And the 88 palette also comes with um, a mirror. The mirror is bigger. And it had two sponge brushes, but I always throw those away because I use the professional brushes. But in comparison to mirrors, this one is way bigger. Hope that's not glaring off. Okay. As far as colors, obviously you're going to get more colors in the F palette because it's um, 100 and this one is 88. Hold on. But I'm trying to put them up against each other. Both of them have um, a variety of colors. If I had to choose, uh, looking at them, I see... A little bit more colors in the 80, the 100 palette, of course. But that's probably the 12 that this one is lacking. So, they're probably, they're very, they're about the same as far as um, variety. Here's a close-up of that palette. And here's this one. I don't know, for some reason, since I've been a professional MUA, which to month, today is my three month anniversary being an MUA. Yeah, it's only been three months. I know I'm the bum. But anyway, um, I like the circle look better. I don't know why it just look professional to me. And this looks like what grandma used to give you in the Christmas kit. <laughs> 
but no offense grandma but yeah that's that okay as far as color payoffs what i'm gonna do is do a quick finger swatch on both of the palettes sorry i know the camera's probably shaking on both of the palettes because i don't feel like reaching for a brush just to be honest let me get a good color let me see red red is such a hard color to find so i'm gonna finger swatch this red if you can see it it's pretty good let me see if I can smear it on my skin. Hey, there we go. It's the light. That's the color payoff with that one. Now I gotta find some light. Well, I can use another finger. And the red in the 100 palette. Swipe it with this hand. That's that payoff. I'm not flipping y'all off, sorry. <laughs> And if I put it, I'm going to put it above the Coastal Scents swatch. Uh-oh. I see a difference, you guys. It's above it. So, the Coastal Scent is a little bit more pigmented. Yeah, a whole lot. So, I guess as far as pigmentation, obviously, Coastal Scent won. So, I guess there's advantages and disadvantages of each palette. I think both of them are great for their money. I don't think they're great for professional use, but I do think they're great. Like I always say, if you have a teenage daughter or you're not really into makeup, you just want to wear it and to have all the colors to match your outfits. Or if you're practicing, oh, sorry, if you're practicing being a makeup, um, MUA or makeup artist, they're really good to start off with. As far as price, um, the L palette is cheaper, but it's not as pigmented. pigmented. As far as packaging, both of them need a little bit of work. As far as colors, both of them have a good variety of colors. The 100 palette got colors that the 88 don't have, of course. As far as shipment, <coughs> the 88 palette comes in like two days. And it's bubble wrap. Um, you don't have to worry about it being broken. Now, the L palette, it took me a week to get that palette. If longer i think probably yeah, it probably took like a week and it wasn't bubble wrap it was in a bubble wrap envelope so luckily mine was in one piece because i've been hearing a lot of complaints about people getting theirs and it hasn't if you have any questions about the ada palette or the elf um 100 palette i will post both links to the palettes um in the description bar and if you want me to do like a look with one um i probably do it um one with two face Thursdays, one elf, one coastal scent, just so you guys can see the difference. But if you have any requests or anything, just hit me up in my email, and that's also going to be in the description bar. Hope this was um, informative. And like I said, if you have any questions, just let me know. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Bye.